Hello, okay, we'll be having another episode today uh, to review MG, Master Grade Fennis Rhina Sista. So, this is actually, I wouldn't say it's a new mold. Uh, this is more to think half of it is uh, using existing uh, Gundam Wing part. So, this is basically from a Gundam Build fight, and uh, we're gonna look through some of the part inside and review some of the booklet then. So as you see, um, the part here also, I wouldn't say very much, but it's a very good kit to build and spend time with also. Because you will be added with steel part, and one of my favorite is the clear part here, which is quite interesting. We're gonna review that later. So let me look through the booklet first. Fenris Rhinos Sista is also the base is using a uh, wing and uh, the part also here is this, let me see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 and it comes with a free base so that you can do posing because this kit is transformable and uh, you will see a lot of uh, accessory part that you don't need to use so in the process you'll have an extra part maybe you can use to keep bash and let's go through the book here is the join the body part quite interesting okay. here's the posing some of the storyline and uh, what is the spec of actual skill okay. Okay, right. so here's the decal so for those who are not much of a fan of decal is a very good MG for you then. So let's go through the runner now. As I mentioned just now, this is my favorite part. You see, uh, this is this clear part is also crafted with panel line. It's a very fun for do posing. The yellow part and the green part. And one of my favorite is how they craft the wing is the sharp the edge. Whoever, whoever that like the mecha have a sharp design, this is one for you. You see the details very very well crafted. So here's the decal. Not much also, I think uh, from 1 to 39 only. So if you don't want to get yourself pissed and want to build something nice, yes, you should choose this one. Inner frame. Well, inner frame... Some of it is quite nice, but some of it is actually using existing also. So later I will invite our special guest to talk about a little bit the inner frame. Okay. Here you go, the outer, the head. Nice. Okay. So this is the base that I mentioned. Alright. This is the outer leg. I like the panel lining. Not much, but the panel lining is really well detailed. Especially the fin here. The leg part. Whoever that have collected the previous uh, Gundam Wing, uh, the original one, should get. We should really get this one because this is very very interesting in the sense of posing and designing. So. Let's see the one that already built. Okay, so as you see, this one is already built by Boy Alexi. And uh, I want to ask a few of the questions also, and uh, what is the process and how, what he like about these kits also. So, welcoming now, uh, Boy Alexi. So, Boy Alexi is a very very uh, talented modeler and he spent a lot of time crafting, modifying and also uh, been sharing his tips how to build Gundam with his passion. So boy, uh, thank you for coming and uh, review with us with this fanis. So first question I want to ask what you like the most about this fanis. Okay, hi. Um, the first thing uh, is the sharp angles. For example, the shoulder and of course the wing, uh, the knee and the leg, thin area. 
and next is the uh, overall proportion of the kit it's uh, very balanced I mean the height of the body the length of the leg and uh, the separation of color as well separation is good separation is good and the best thing is it can hold that it can hold the uh, heavy weapon oh heavy that's, interesting. Yep. that's interesting mm. without the palm tilting so what's so different with the previous one in the sense of holding the weapon got any mm. loose, or not, loose part I haven't built any of uh, wing variation before so uh, so do you have any loose part happening in this model kit? Nope, everything is good, everything is solid Everything is solid Yeah okay. So how long you take to build this? I think roughly around 8 hours or so 8 hours Without or so. carrying any nut marks So any else uh, special design or part or feature that you like from this kit? Yeah, this cup of the head The head? Yeah Why? It's way different than the HD version Okay And it's not as close as the anime but mm. definitely way better yeah, I found out that this design is very sharp and very edgy. Yes. Uh, it's very interesting. And especially the wing area. So, for those who want to collect a uh, wing, will you recommend this wing series or any kind of uh, uh, MG one? Yeah, if you're a Transformable fan or GBF and you wing, this is a must get. Really a must get? Yeah. Okay. Alright, I think uh, that is the. Uh, our special guest boy Alexi to check out his work you can visit his uh, Facebook so what's your Facebook uh, link or any page or Instagram uh, Instagram is ALX Gunpla Works mm -hmm. and so, Facebook is BOY Alexi okay. A -L -E -X -I. cool so if you guys want to check out his work just visit Instagram or Facebook and thank you for coming to review this so hope you to uh, see more and subscribe our channel thank you very much All right.